I help injured people recover fair compensation from injuries they've suffered in an accident. I want to talk to you about wrist and hand injuries. I've represented hundreds of uh, people that have suffered wrist and hand injuries in accidents. Uh, very often, which is uh, credible, they, they suffer those injuries uh, when they trip and fall or slip and fall. But also, I've represented numerous clients that are, have suffered uh, hand and wrist injuries in car accidents. Um, there is frequently the case in which an impact is so severe that uh, a person who has his hands on the steering wheel um, and, and the impact, uh, the force of the impact causes the, the hands to break or the wrists to break or the hands to come off the steering wheel by the force of the impact and hit the dashboard or something else in the car and they break their wrists and hands. Um, it's said other than the human brain that the hands uh, are the most necessary tools that we have as human beings and it separates us from all the other animals. And to lose, uh, even for a short period of time, the use of your, your one hand uh, and frequently two hands is a terrible thing to go through. Uh, first of all, uh, there are times when uh, surgery is necessary and uh, we have to make sure that the, the client who comes into our office and, and has these types of injuries uh, gets the right kind of surgery by the right kind of surgeon who is competent and well qualified so they have the best chance to recover. Sometimes the uh, client is uh, already treated and already uh, had surgery in a hospital or an outpatient setting and they come to us afterwards and in that case we have to make sure that everything was done correctly and if they need a, a second surgery or if they need extensive physical therapy we know uh, doctors who will examine them to make sure the surgery was done correctly and uh, physical therapists who will uh, treat them and both the, the orthopedic surgeons and the, the, the uh, therapists that we send our clients to are not only qualified but they will wait until the case is either settled or we get a judgment against the person who hurt them uh, before they expect payment. Um, I have uh, at least five clients in my office right now that we're representing uh, of the probably, as I said, over 100 people that I've represented for these kinds of injuries uh, that suffered uh, hand and, and wrist injuries in both trip and fall and auto accident cases. Um, it's hard for insurance companies to understand how uh, much this type of injury interferes with a person's life. Even if it's not their, their dominant hand that's involved, we use both of our hands to do almost all tasks, whether it's housework, uh, yard work, uh, cooking, and especially nowadays in the modern age when we, everybody uses a keyboard. Uh, to uh, type on their uh, uh, iPad or on their um, laptop or to use their cell phone to text or to search. So it, it, it can interfere greatly with your, your daily activities of life and not only your work but everything you do. Uh, whether it's something as important as driving a car or something uh, as personal as caressing your loved one. Uh, so we make sure when a client comes in with this types of injuries and they, they either have or haven't had uh, the surgery already, if they need one, that uh, we send them to orthopedic specialists who deal with hands and wrists. Now there's many different kinds of orthopedic doctors and one size does not fit all. There's doctors that specialize in elbows, uh, shoulders, knees, uh, the back, the spine, but there's also doctors who specialize in hand and wrist injuries. And we want to make sure that our client uh, deals with a doctor that is specialized in this type of injury because somebody who operates on shoulders or knees, they're not the right doctor to, to uh, treat this client. 
very frequently the surgery that's involved is what's called microsurgery, uh, that you're dealing with the uh, microscopic nerves and tendons and tissues and things of this nature. So you want to make sure a doctor is very competent. So we always deal with the best doctors, the most qualified doctors, and again, doctors who will wait until the case is over. So uh, whether a person is injured um, in falling and breaks their wrist or hand or is injured in a car accident, we know how to present the case to the insurance company uh, to get the just and fair compensation they're entitled to. And if the insurance company does not want to step up, we will go all the way uh, to court and to trial if necessary. And one thing to remember is when you come to my office and you have a, a hand or wrist injury, you deal with me. I make sure I get to know my clients. Uh, I do the intake. I talk to the clients in person. And if I have to see them in the office or see them at their house, if they can't come into the office, I am the one that handles it. I don't turn it over some assistant uh, to handle the important parts of the case. We're always there for the client. We always return phone calls. Uh, we make sure that they're treated right.